In the last five years, uh, cataract surgery has grown tremendously in technological advances. One of the advances that uh, we use a lot is the Symphony intraocular lens. It's an extended depth of focus intraocular lens that allows the patients to see from about 16 inches to infinity. They can read most things, medium-sized print without glasses, and for probably 70 to 80 percent of their daily tasks, they don't wear glasses. This lens is a lens that uh, we are using in patients that have irregular corneas. I'm involved in the study, national study, that we're looking at patients that have had RK, PRK, and LASIK. Those patients, their corneas are not quite as smooth as a patient who hasn't had that type of surgery. If you look at the surface of the cornea, it's perfectly smooth like a sphere, like a bowling ball, with no imperfections. When you have had RK, or PRK, or LASIK, a refractive procedure, it does change the shape of your cornea, and you have some small little lumps and bumps and irregular surfaces in the cornea, and that's called aberrations in the cornea, spherical aberrations. And the lens that we use now, the Symphony, allows us to actually smooth out those aberrations so patients have much better vision with this type of lens. The Symphony also helps uh, um, color perception. It actually corrects color perception in patients where the blues are really blue, the greens are really, are really green. It's a, it's a very technology advanced lens that allows us to give the patients much better vision than they've had in the past. I consider the Symphony intraocular lens the Swiss Army knife of intraocular lenses in that it can provide correction for farsightedness, nearsightedness, astigmatism, as well as near vision, presbyopia for our patients. It's the only intraocular lens in the world that can do that at this present time.